What is happening, y'all? Welcome back. Got more dogma happening today. We're actually playing Dragon's Dogma 2 now. Everyone's been, where's the title screen at? Well, there you go. Welcome to the post game. So since we are at post game, um, obviously, spoilers are off the table. This is this is the end of the game. You know, we covered the the first ending in the last stream. So, just fair warning, because I know somebody's gonna be like, "Well, well, I didn't get here yet." Like, well, probably shouldn't have clicked it. Um, but yeah, we got a lot to do in the unmoored world. We're gonna get our pawn, clear some of the red clouds, and then uh, hunt down some baddies. First thing we gotta do. Let's go get our pawn, which is over this way. Must we run everywhere? You are an impatient one, Arisen. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. That's right, we're finally on to the Dragon Star Matu. Everything before now is just Dragon Star 1. Hail, Arisen. Tis plain you've been training diligently in my absence. Why are you holding your tummy? What is what is going on with you, Liliana? Are you Are you sick? Uh something's something's wrong with her. I don't know. I ain't picking her up right now. I'll let somebody else grab her first. I think it's this way to get to him. Ender's Magnolia? No. Is that... It's not out yet, isn't it? I know it's the sequel to Ender Lilies, but Will I don't think that's out yet. Explain what is happening? It seems the world is to be brought to an end. Pawn is not pregnant. Is to come to pass. Not weird. You yet live. I suspected as much, given that your pawn still remains. One might hypothesize that your pawn is sustained by your vital essence. Or perhaps something more. Rebirth DLC? <laughs> Maybe. In any case, we ought to apprise one another of the situation. Is there, or indeed, then in your absence, I have tell me arisen. So following your plunge into the sea on the dragon's back, could that have been the world forged? Yet why would such a being and speculate I shall? Now, if you can find a way to it. Oh master, how long I've slept. Far too long, it seems. But worry not. Now that I'm awake, I shall So Rush is back. Alright, next is Halls of the First Dawn, which involves saving all of the major cities. What do you mean published? Like, put into paper? Danger might lurk anywhere. Wear every shadow. And mind the ceiling. Be sure to keep your wits about you. 
Her Majesty has begun her supplications. None may see her ere they conclude. Stay your hand, Vera. This one may pass. Come hither. We would speak. The same is true of... So you are returned. We are gladdened to find you safe and well. And now, to what do we owe the pleasure of... You would have the people of this nation abandon their homeland to seek sanctuary elsewhere. Tis no small thing you are... For now, prithee speak with Sir Manella. Her assistance will be... Uh, I'm gonna wait till I can stream Godzilla. Trying to take a toddler out to the movie theater is just pain. Just experience a balance enhancement from Vermin? Uh, depends how you're playing it. But balance is a safe bet. This one's a pain in the ass. The rest aren't bad. It's a dragon stone. You saw the sky fall, I trust. And wherever the sky falls, or so I had assumed. Yet aught here, I must examine that creature. It may well be the key to. I can see where we need to go, but some fell power is blocking our way. Many parts are close to us now, on account of the dragon's descent, no doubt. But we must find a way to reach it. Confound this obstruction. But I suppose I ought to have expected this. Answers were ne'er so easily won. I gotta Answers reach the dragon. Summoned by that beast, no doubt. You're going the wrong way, bro. I'm supposed to follow him. I don't know why he's going this way, but... Principles unproven are as dust on the wind. This one's an exemplary performance. I just think what we could achieve if we honed our talents further. It seems this is the only way. Where are you going, bro? This wasn't the way forward at all. Naught can be achieved without sacrifice.
Enough dallying. Follow me. My pawns. A fine welcome indeed. I can... Alas, a theory unproven is of little practical use. Come on, let's go. Where are you going, buddy? The rest of them, I just get to show up and smash a boss, but this first one, you gotta like go through the city and follow him and. If you don't smash it, uh, everybody dies. Pretty straightforward. Save the day or everybody dies. <laughs> What are you- where are you going? Are you going- what? You were taking the most convoluted route there, I swear to god. Like, push his ass along. I'm trying to push him along. You just you buy this from the Dragon Forge in post game. Dragon Forged has best in slot weapons, but you need to be post game to get them. I'm not interested in that game, Beast. Have I really uncovered the truth of the dragon? Destroying the crystals gives you more time in the Unmortal World. You go from, like... You go from, uh, like... Three days to like twelve. Oh, oh, what are y'all doing? Where the fuck is everybody? Heal! Yo, I'm replacing your ass. Fucking Liliana would not be struggling to heal me in these fights. 
You're not keeping up anyway. The dragon at the heart of all this destruction. I don't know, Serta. Maybe. I think the dragon plague doesn't detonate. I think it would just, like, it would just stay manifested until you rest out of town. Drops in any game are better than Dragon Forge. I've not seen proof. Yeah, I've I've heard of like weird helmet, like uh, the helmets you can get, but that's it. I haven't heard anything about some kind of like rare, mega rare loot or anything. Why did you destroy it? The ah shit! We might have learned. I think I'm supposed to destroy it though. <sighs> Never mind. You've your charge, it is true, and the fiends appear to be falling back. But I trust you won't object if I take a sample of its remains. After all, your role is to save this. Go, do what you must. Some day soon, and on that day. We save the day. You've pushed your luck too far. I'll not take that from you. Pray calm yourselves, good people. I will have none of this squabbling. Sir Manella, you don't understand. This... No, you don't understand. This is no... We shan't weather this calamity. Have a little faith in your To think that vase was in truth. A scholarly pursuit. I think I'm supposed to. Let me see. Um, yes, yeah, so I think you destroy it no matter what. Dragon. It was clever of you to realize its true nature. Ah, sir, with the world in such disarray, I could not stand to be away from my homeland. Thus did I return, to render what aid I may. I maintain order as best I can, but for every fire I extinguish, but enough of my woes. I thought the endgame was awesome. Just to evacuate. Mayhap the idea merits some thought. After all, if we sit on our haunches, alas, the peep should we proceed but with every soul that there are such, and should you encounter such efforts, will die as for me. There's no mere tavern brawl we are to mediate, Master. Do you caution us at what's your business with me, Cos? Put your back into it. Looks like we both got some time on our hands. Have a little faith in yourself. Haven't you? You'll get what's coming to As for me. These writings could be of import. It couldn't hurt to take a peek. They're not Khajiit and they don't have I, tails. I saw it first. <laughs> Trust a flea. Uh, why must I share with a fangless one? 
You there. You put this upstart in his place for me, won't you? Go on, lay into it. If that's what you think. All right, clear off. You said it's bad to hurt people. Please, let this be a... All I have is rotten food. Oi, leave my kid alone. What's that you've got? What is half rotten? Do you mean to... I say we call a truce while we put paid to... Oi, agreed. A menace... That's not what I... That's that's not what I missed. I figured I had, like, apples or something on me. Rally! You've got him right where you want him. Let me get some food. Um... With Banishers or Fantasy Relink? Uh, I mean, I, I enjoyed both, but obviously very, very different games. I mean, I, I would say that that comes down to what you want, because they are two completely different games. Is all of my food rotten? Rotten, rotten. I got some dried meat. And some dried fruit. There we go. I'll it's do that. Do come again. I didn't have anything but rotten meat, bro. I just want to see what happens. Ah, you, you slander my. Right, so that's the duel. Hang on. Let me go help the the kids. Uh huh. There's something written. Couldn't hurt to take a peek. Oi! I saw why must I share with a fat You there, put this upstart in his play if that's what you I right, clear off. We all urge the people to fit you said it's bad to hurt people. Oh, thanks, sir. Really? Thanks. That's mighty kind of you. Oi, leave my kid alone. You're not some child snatcher, are you? Wait. You shared your food with them. I thank you, sir. As for you, I. Mayhap we're not so different. The desire to protect one's kin transcends race and culture. It just goes to show we are none of us so different. A resounding success. First time I did this, it was a, a hot mess. Now, now, if we are to do otherwise, who's to I? Well, sir, what say you? You have my gratitude. How about you? <laughs> See, there's as much playtime in Bakhbatal as Vernworth. Um, probably close to it. You should really think of it, think of the game like Eastern Vernworth, Western Vernworth, Bakbatal, and Volcanic, and then post-game. If we consider all of Vernworth Act 1, it's definitely the longest, but Bakbatal is, is also pretty long, and post-game is pretty long. I pray you! I, I admit it. Nay. We owe you a debt where it's not for your indeed. It seems some things can only be resolved by crossing blades. But I doubt they'll quarrel again after this. Such moments make me proud to serve the original. Ten I've had well enough of your nitpick. I reckon the world would be better. Oi, you! Oi, leave off or we'll. Have you lost your bloody mind? Reckon you could just cut us down in the streets? What's the matter with you? Hey? 
fine, fine. It shows a violent method of resolution. These hands are rated E for everyone. Ah, Sir Arisen. In less pressing circumstances, I would take issue with your methods. The people of Batal are beginning to see that they we shall see the fruit prey return to Empress Nadinia, and heavens only know how many lives you have. What say we report back to Empress Nadinia? Her Majesty ought be willing to commence the evacuation now. Uh, maybe heal all the health I'm missing. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait right there. You know what? Me... Hail arisen. Yeah, we're just gonna get rid of you. It's plain. You don't get a gift. Mm. Tis a pity we must part after sharing. I'm well such glad to be traveling. She's never healing me. I don't know what's wrong with her, but she never. She's never healing me. I'm like always on the verge of death. Liliana runs up and heals. Like the second you're missing health, she's like, I need to top you off. You are an impatient one, Arisen. No time to catch your breath. Try to keep up. You save the one Empress? Uh, I mean, it's a whole long chain. In the city. You have our gratitude for your efforts. Your journey continues, does it not? Pray excuse the interruption, your majesty. Indeed. Forgive us, but... Alright, so Batal is done. Um, let's see... I gotta do Batal, Vernworth, Sacred Arbor, Volcanic Island, and Excavation Site. If I might be so bold as to speak my mind, oft I find myself wondering how I fared as a fighter. Now that I'm a warrior, naught shall stand in our way again. My steel will topple every foe in our path. Um, I should go over to here. Yeah, let me... I gotta get the red lights first. I don't think there's... I don't know if there's more quests here. Let's go help the elves. Yeah, elves. I want to trade gear between two accounts. I finished the game and would like to start a new game with my other account. What, are, what do you mean? Like, like a second Steam account? You would just rent your pawn and gift them a bunch of shit. Yeah, rent, rent the level 1 pawn on your high level account and give it a bunch of gear and gifts. Bane Worm. Big whiffs. I usually use Magic Archer to kill this thing, so we'll see how Warrior goes.
Thief would probably tear this up. Listen here, you little shit. Oh my god. Stop running. Bro, you're gonna get me to change classes. What is Ron's pawn doing? Yeah, this is a very poor fight for Warrior. Alright, I gotta like... Get ahead of where it's going. go. That was a good one. I added Ron's Ranger in so that I could like actually enjoy playing Warrior without all the meteors and shit. But it's definitely making this particular fight a pain in the ass. I gotta like, I gotta get rid of Ron, I think, and add a, add a thief into the party. I got him, I got him. Lay him down. Oh. 
It's very different from Mystic Archer. This fight took me like 30 seconds. The biggest whiffs! Spearham would probably take this out pretty easily too. Come on, bring your head down. Why are you being a pain in my ass? Oh, oh shit. The Brian Tornado killed me instantly. How fun. Ron got cooked. And Ron and the Liana got cooked. God damn. So fucking annoying, bro. What a feat! The creature is vanquished, and it appears the Red Cloud's advance has been stalled as well. Kirandone Halana, 
Ale kanu nandi. You would gather materials here, monster. Kana el kemen yum. Way over here. I didn't uh, help the Elvish village last time. Lamentari. Lungtena peli telume. Ane martir tindume. Lungtena peli tel. Hmm. I wonder who I gotta talk to to start it up. Probably the girl. Salma Arenfe. Alec Yav Parma Erume. Alana Firemine. Where's she at? Hermin. Can I El Kemen you? The son? I gotta find one of them first. My friend, how glad I am to see you yet live. When word reached me of your uncanny disappearance, I admit I feared the worst. What has become of this world? Our people fear for the future. We cannot be sure we will be safe here, yet this place is all we know, all we have. I think we need to evacuate. I see. I should gladly follow you. Nonetheless, we can but try. As arborist, Sir Toyusin is the leader of the Elven people. Let us follow our guides that we might speak with him. It is as you say. Fiona <laughs> <laughs> Lis fa alda car kemen rose oi andil. Kemen rose elame mor orne arenka lia su. Lia arenka su morivin. Lia morivin ondu iloth mine falis ne kenalien matir. Talan venis in heranon eluisorone eruor. Nun vis aman vakil angadur kemor. Kemen rose andil soron rusa ne karilm ilarato. Moretele erando morivin telume. Findalnar, morivin les hermenan? Nefa oyo sur. Airando vanitol melantar. Minas vana teralia. Alcarwa fir nun eldaya. Ane martir tindome ingarina fa alme alcarwa. Sorne an famelto, vanalin ne hiros soron, lera ne fir heranon, an ne arpehe. Only time will tell whether the cutting shall take root. For now, let us make for the seafloor shrine. To the seafloor shrine. We've made it then. What's our first order of business? This arisen. Plant the seedling. Mm, I gotta go the other way, I think, to get there.
Where do we plant this little guy? I feel like I plant it like right here. I don't know. I've never done this quest, so. Do I just like... Assuming I got a planted here. Yeah. Let's see. Um one thing says there should just be a plot of dirt in the middle of the area. Oh, there we go. We are little welcome here, in spite of our amicable intentions. Let us endeavor not to give our hosts any reason to doubt us. Casinke telpe nun findaler, aidalia anandor. Nenambue yavstir uru findalnar, kemen ros uru neteren, ne romen anar telpe men. Du intarmi ki nailen meltol, ne meltol linkan aldakar, an fir nun fiamor. Palan hiar menran, elorato ala, nun mor ata. Nenwen mor aiwanon, iav stir lalasta, nun falasmir magananon, ano. I thank you, friend. It would be no exaggeration to say that you have saved my people. Your fight continues, does it not? Be well. Level 60, Sarosh. I gotta deposit some stuff. I'm sitting on, uh... Sitting on a lot of worms crystals. A birthday gift? She, she's got tons of stuff. She got a little little baby trike. She got a bunch of toys. She got some clothes. Okay, in fair Averhum. No, do not rest. I'll get that for you. We are not resting. We have no time to rest. Alright. Go to Vernworth. Get that one done. This ladder can take us to new heights. After you arisen. This looks as good a place as any. Your Majesty, how glad I am to see you safe. The end of the world. Though, I am aware of the dragon attack on Mel. It was a tragedy, and I would not see it repeated. However, without a clear path, we and the guard shall be hard pressed to force. You would have me evacuate the city. Ever since the fall of Mel, the citizens of. If there is safe harbor to be found, but I doubt I could. Methinks, Your Majesty, after the false sovereign vanished, and if the people will heed it. Maintaining order in vermin must be quite a burden upon the young region, Ken. Let us aid him however we may. Tis easily done. Go help him. And then we'll do the volcanic town. And then we'll do a 
final part. So you can plus make the game harder. Um, not particularly. Enemies are mostly scaled to the zones you're at. So like when you start a new game plus, everything is going to be easier than the shit you're fighting here in post game. But I've heard someone say that like once you're at, I think past 150, enemies start scaling in terms of their health or something. I like it to be harder in general. Uh, I think they should just add a hard mode like they did to the original. I think that'd be fine. You got more discipline and experience, but enemies were significantly harder. So you've come. I'm Captain Brandt has already apprised me of your proposal. Of truth be told, I had reached the same conclusion. So long as we cow within these walls, we must live in fear of going the way of Mel. Sirash was killing a griffin on his own as a random pawn traveling the world. My That's how Sirash do it, baby. He's the goat. The encampment survivors and the thieves guild for eight. The only remaining obstacle is my mother. She I have tried to make. However, I fear that my position I must put the needs of the now. There are a few matters I must attend. We will require set. Might I prevail upon you? You may assure him that the royal treasury will foot a. Queen Regent Deesa hardly leaves her chambers between you and me. I fear for her health. <laughs> Have you come to claim my life, Arisen? But I shall go to the grave with a smile on my lips, for I have... So do as you will. Do with me as you will. What are you doing? Unhand me at once! You said do what I will. What? Help me. We're going for a little walk. Mm. I'm not sure what happens if I yeet her into the great beyond. There you go. That's where you belong now. Knowing the Queen Regent, that's probably worse than killing her. You know, smell like ox, sweat and shit and piss and... Throw the Queen in the barn, that's the way to do it. Bring her to the boy regent? Well, right now she's hanging out with the ox, so... As long as I get my gold, who takes the... We have chartered the ox carts as requested. It is a pleasant change for things to go so smoothly, eh, master? Not a bad idea. Yes, now she is the stank queen. I mean, I didn't. I I killed her in my first playthrough. <laughs> I think I did. I think I beat her up. Oh, 
rowling. Time for an earth. What is the order for saving the people? Uh, the bigger thing is just taking care of the, the purples, the, the clouds in the sky. Mother, I must beg your forgiveness. I believed that you desired to make it in truth. You sought to bet. Ah, but I would have. Besides, even so, if I had but bet, you would not have had to. Oh, mother, I beg you. I would not see you. That weight is as my son. You tr your kindness will save many lives. She definitely teleported. Ah, you've returned. How th you do? My thanks. That puts paid to the last of our preparations. I led the people to safety in the unmoored world. So I guess I didn't even have to do the volcanic camp to. It was just the, the three cities. We're still gonna do the volcanic camp though. Alright, let's go fight another big thingy. Materials, eh? I shan't deny. They have their uses. Because if you don't do the thingies, the city gets swarmed. We're gonna get- we'll, we'll take care of evacuation site and all that next. Since we're over here, I'm gonna destroy the, uh, the red cloud. Yeah. Um, why? Uh, I would rather if we keep it, I'll eat it. Alright. Don't be giving away any more cakes! I want the cake! I don't want candy, I want cake. Let me eat cake! I was trying to give away the birthday cake. I'm like, no. That's for my belly. Though I was unconscious, I could always sense your presence. What are we fighting? Is there so harpies? Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. Bolt scales. Our foe is repelled. No, I don't want a fairy stone. I want a bolt scale. Safe, at least for the time being. Oh no, we had like, there was a, I don't remember what it was, but the other day there was like a coconut cream cake. And then like, one night I was like, man, coconut cream cake would be so good. Can't wait. And then all of a sudden I went to look for it and it was fucking gone. I'm like, what happened to coconut cream cake? And she's like, oh, I gave it to Jamie. And I'm like, what do you mean you gave it to Jamie? I wanted to eat that. And she's like, oh, I didn't know. And I'm like, you just, just giving away the cakes? Well, it grabbed Ron.
shoot it down. Come on, ugly. You ain't going anywhere. Get back here. I give that to Sirash. You want some too, bitch? Come on down. You better run, ugly. You come down here, you're getting your ass beat. doesn't want to fight. It's like, no. Oh, no, no. Ah! Sirash is running all the way around to beat it up. What's in here? I'll oh, heal. Okay. Go beat its ass. the second part of it. It's alright, Sarash got it down. It's down. Good job, Sarash. If I do enough enough uh, indomitable lashes, I think Sarash will be like, oh, hit the face with this. Okay, it's alright, buddy. That's what we do. Of though, how are we doing on status? Where are we at now? Seven? This pure batali. With the with the warrior, honestly, pure batali is like the only thing to do. Cause you're gonna you're already gonna do a shit ton of knockdown anyway. So I don't think Dwarven is worth it. Come on, come here. Yeah, I gotta add a source for back into the party, I think. What a team we make arisen. 
Pick up that Eldracite, Sirash. There we go. You're dead if this goes off in time. That does take super fucking long to execute. I don't know if it's only available in post game. This is the only place I have found those enemies, but. I know you can occasionally find like Gore Chimeras or Doolahans. They're just. There's like very, very few spawn locations that have them. Hey, there's no big whips there. I got it. enough discipline for the new warrior shit that I want. Go break those heads. One here. Rip. Let's see. I don't remember if this is a dragon or a worm. Waterfall cave is a Gorkamera and a Doolahan? I don't remember a Doolahan there. It's a it's a lich. Isn't it a lich and a Gorkamera? And the Gorkamera, as far as I know, is only after a certain level. Rush, no, you're standing in the brine, buddy. This thing, I don't even think this is a dragon, it's closer to like a phoenix.
but I was high enough, but I'm not. Probably like Diluvian strike it. A little lightning rain, okay. Come on, fall down. Liana's got the heels. That's the thing, like fighting fighting uh, Grigori kind of lackluster, but fighting these things? These things are wild. Which I will say, this is a lot, like, Magic Archer just obliterates it, so you don't even really get to, like, experience the fight. This is a very, very different experience from how it was the last time I did this. Get it out of the sky! Oh, get up! Mm. Get that last, last spot there, Sirash! beginner honestly just play whatever you want you can freely swap between vocations so there's no like what oh what is the best starter or what should i stick with like pick something that sounds cool and if you're not enjoying it just pick something else too many games have ingrained into people that there's like they have to do like an optimal start and that's not the case at all with this game in fact, the whole the whole thing that makes this such a fun game is the fact that you're given the freedom to just do do whatever you want. Yeah, bust its neck open. Wait, this is the wrong move. Now is the time for my upper cut. Hey, how about you land so I can hit you with the big boom? You know you want to. Yeah, you know what? I think I will put Indomitable Lash back on Suresh. I mean, I'm chunking with that. But I think he's doing Windstorm, which I think Windstorm is better. Big stagger on the head. Blade the uppercut too.
I mean, I don't know how Trickster would work on this. You would probably just buff your pawns and let them murder the shit out of it. Okay. He is done. So now we're gonna make the trek. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna mark it. And I'm gonna go that way. Well, no, let me hang on. Let me let me do this properly. Um bum 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 bum. This is the end of the story. And here we are. In the blink of an eye. Shall we take stock of our surroundings? <laughs> <laughs> this looks as if it will take us someplace further afield. How we use it is at our discretion. You know, Solge, I'd not recommend camping. You'll await me the blanket of ash. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's... Mountain Breaker. We finally have that goes there. Tired old Wrath. Do I want Gale Slash? No, it's not upgraded. I have a chain launch. Where's the, um... Where's the one where I jump on their head? That's Surging Strike. Alright, so Sirash. We have Mountain Breaker for KO. We have Windstorm for damage. We have Counter. And then I guess Deluvian is good if he climbs on top of something. He'll Deluvian. No, I'm sure I need that. Give you a roof over your head at least. Um, I got. Oh, we got plenty of those. We're good. Always a pleasure. <laughs> tornado spell? The ballista is a ranged weapon. Yeah, tornado good. Make use of this. Ah, I remember you. What brings you to the encampment? It is a miracle you're still alive. Though I dare say that's true of all of us. Oh? You believe we ought to evacuate? Well, you've traveled far indeed to deliver these tidings. Farther, I dare say, than anyone would go for the sake of an idle jest. Hmm. If we must, but I think we're a bit short on hand. In fact, a blacksmith and his the smith. The, well, suffice you to have naught to do with us. I can only hope, and while you're taking care of that. Ah. Uh. We're gonna go snatch them. Remember the blacksmith and his lady wife. Well, convince them to join the Dragon's Play hasn't affected this playthrough. We've been chilling. Well now, whatever brick You'd have us evacuate with the encampment. I am touched by your kindness. Now now, I'll hear none of that. I'll see you to safety, my dear. Come hell or I water. Besides, I should hope this good soul has earned your trust by now. Help me out of a tight spot on more than one occasion, if you'll recall. After all that goodwill and the long trek out. Oh, very well, my love. Would you be so kind as to escort us? For the seat. We'll escort you right back. I'll charge you to the encampment. But the Shazam! Well, here we are. How long before the evacuate? Would you find? Let him know that we'll wait. We would gather Speed run in them quests. Can we really afford to carry more? Where's Sir Ernesto at? Yeah, it's like a whole different game once you get here, Dirk. I 
do not understand. What has befallen our world? Who would wish for such a calamity? Or refuse to let this be the end of things? Alright, seriously, where the hell did Ernesto go? Is he in this hut, maybe? Ooh, fresh grapes. Ernesto, is that him? Sir, I implore you to reconsider. How many times must I say it? Now bugger off and leave me alone. Ah, good. You're, I'm afraid there's another matter. It concerns the fellow I was... The man, something of a regular... I sought him out to tell him of the evacuation. I must confess. Could I prevail at this point? If he thinks anything I... Sir Lamond is as mighty as... Fancy meeting ye here, cuz. <laughs> not this again. I'm here to live my life as I see fit. I'll not be ordered about by anyone. Not even ye. Oh, bollocks. Of course you'd make a decent request like that. Aye, fine. I'll do it. Seeing as you're the one asking. Can't say I'll be glad to leave this place behind. But you've my word. I'll get him to safety. This ladder looks sturdy enough. Sir Lamon shall be a boon to the evacuation effort. Let us inform Sir Ernesto of our success. I cannot thank you enough for all you've done. We shall fare much better on the road with Sir Lamont's arm to defend us. It will be slow going, mind. Yet, come what may. The people of Volcanic Island are evacuated. May they make it through the impending chaos intact. Now, now y'all get to see why we kept the Talos alive. This part's pretty fucking cool. Ah, a material. Useful things, these. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. Ah, arisen. We would make use of this stone gigantus, Talos, it is called, to intercept the dragon's attacks from the skies. Nah, dude, Ark of Might absolutely will one-tap stuff. You can do, like, four to five health bars with it if you hit a weak spot. Fortunately, we believe it was once powered by some... It appears we found a ballista. But you have to hit the first portion of the wind-up, and on top of that... You gotta hit a weak spot. We were we were doing like three, four health bars on Griffins just a few days ago with it. Sirash, no! Sirash become Talos. hit both shots on Drake's heart and it doesn't even hit half a health bar, you, you gotta be whiffing it then, dude. Like, you're, you're missing something, because we've done it on stream, and I've chunked three to four health bars off of Drake. Like, I get the knockdown, I arc of my Drake dies. If you don't have Talos, you gotta fight these yourself. But if you have Talos... Behold. He just fucks it up. It's just a cutscene. Sirash is still learning how to pilot it.
Talos punch. But now the wormy boy comes. Fuck him up, Talos. You see a risen? We have naught to fear from any overgrown lizard. Me to fly to your Bro, we're watching the fight right now. Get out of here. Man, some of these pawns, they're like fucking solicitors. Come on, Talos, get that snake. You see a risen? I still got one arm, bitch. The hero overcame all the trials of the unmoored world. Uh, where did the head fall off? I gotta go pick up all the uh, worms crystals that it dropped. Hey, welcome to Booty Champion, Jacob. We gotta go to the camp anyway. There's there's a evacuation site thing that we can do. Is this a challenge arisen to see who can keep pace? Man, Ron's pawn is so fucking snippy. Yeah, we're gonna go by Harv. Alright, so we are now on the clock. Our party is well balanced. I can see no weaknesses that might be exploited. <laughs> I don't want hobgoblins, I want bigger stuff.
Damn, bro, trying to spit oil at me. Dragon over here probably respawned. No, we're trying to go. We're trying to get to the head too. I always forget where the head rolled down to. You must stay clear of fire. I want to say it's like, isn't it? Isn't the head uh like over here or something? I don't want to go in the lava. Go oh, away. Go away. here looking for a dragon and the head I don't remember where I fought it I think it's past the camp or chimeras there should be one at the waterfall place and then there's one that's like outside of a bar of after shit hits the fan Fuck, I'm on fire. I'm getting caught by the lot of slime, bro. No, not like this. Get off of me, fucking lava slime, bro! I need a sorcerer back in this party. Oh, Jesus Christ. Listen, I'm going to get to you in a second after Liliana's back up. No, shit, shit, shit. Help, 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 help. Oh.
I could have killed this fucking thing already if that damn slime didn't grab me. Bruh, land. You want to act like this? I'm stunned. Son of a bitch. Do I not have anything to heal with? Now's when it dies. If I get this off in time. Boom! Told you, man. Arc of Mike can clap. But you gotta use it at the right moment. Feast your eyes on this. Like, honestly, the, the only time you should really deploy Arc of Might at all is after a knockdown. Because if you use it and the target's not knocked down, you have a higher chance to whiff, you're gonna win yourself, like, you use it to just end fights. But that's why you combine it with Mountain Breaker, because you get the knockdown, boom! Arc of Might destroys. And then your other two abilities are really just whatever you want. You know, you could go for the, the Surge thing, to use it to just sprint around the map. You could do Diluvian, to ha help, uh... Knock shit out of the sky. Tidal Wrath for a counterattack. Like, really, anything works. I'm the blender, bitch. is on PC. But yeah, no, Arc of Might, unfortunately, pawns just aren't very good with it. Because your palm will just use it in combat. Or they'll do, they'll do partial arcs. They'll do this. Which, like, yeah, I killed the Harpies, but I also winded myself. And that's the problem with it, is it, it uses all of your stamina. And so the best time to use that is going to be finish the fight. Uh, over here, if I try to do it quick. Like, I killed that one and I hurt that one, but once again, I'm fucking winded. And so now I'm useless for... You know, I'm just sitting here waiting. Just waiting before I can fight again.
That was a fucking whiff. Holy shit. Fall off. Yeah, golems are one of those classes where or one of those monsters where your class will make a huge difference. Like, as a thief, a golem is fucking easy. As a warrior, you really need to lube into the snipe metals. All we gotta do is get its foot! There we go. Victory. Thank you, friend. This place does not- I'd gladly accompany- Follow me. You'll see what I mean. One Electrum from killing his whole ass? Damn, bro. Second, I gotta go to the innkeeper real fast. To the innkeeper. So I can heal. He already left. Big rip. Yeah, Deluvian carried that whole fight right there. As a means of transport. It would be interesting to see where it might take us. I can foresee no reason not to make use of this. Is a jail of sorts. They were supposed to be. I confess. I. Come to think of it. Master, a treasure chest. Well, he they refused to leave. I know they don't die. I never wanted to be. I suppose that's why. At any rate, I've... The command came a month ago. We ought to remain here. I implore you, Aris. So they're staying, and they told you that. It's strange. But never mind that. It was the overseers. When the world changed, but on his way out, I expect that order of... Listen, friend. If the overseer's command... Use that key to help. Best keep your eyes peeled for the... Bulls need only obey the true arisen. I suspect one of those fell artifacts employed at the coronation. Is what was she talking about? She was like a chest. I don't see a chest here. So. A chest in one of these jails? No. No. Uh, have you checked if we can still use the forgery system to copy mats? I haven't, but I don't think it would work. Only because when you copy stuff, it says, um... Like, when you go and copy it, it says, like, it doesn't have the function. So, I'm pretty sure copying materials would just result in one that's unable to be used for blacksmithing. But, this is all conjecture, of course. I haven't actually tested this.
It does work. I've been doing it with Cars Doolahan bones. Well, well shit. That's cool. Well met, sir. Uh, fairy stone. Hang on. Uh, I want a fairy stone. I'll take your panacea. I'll take those. I'll take all of those. How's the day? Do come again? I like how on my uh on my other save where I'm like new game plus two, someone's like, You have so much gold, you had to obviously cheat. Meanwhile, streamed the entire playthrough of this and we're at one point zero one mil. People get so salty. The dumbest shit. So, the pawns were being held here by the power of this god's way. Now they ought to be free to make good their escape. Oh, I like that. Like, honestly, the only time I think gold is a problem is at, like, the very start of this. And even then, it's, like, only if you're trying to buy everything right at the start. Like the best thing to do is is you know if, if you're playing a thief and your pawn is playing a warrior you max out both your trade gear and then when you go to something else you probably have arts that are already going to work for it so i'll wager he thought he always was a spiteful old at any rate i'm well grateful only hope they'll heed but i'm not worried i'll find a way to my word with this now there's no chance of any of them being seems I've no end of things to thank you. I appreciate all you've done here. With this, their evacuation is all but assured. God's ways are loathes of artifacts. Well, and I suppose they have their uses. Shepherd of the Pawns. Not bad. All things considered. Alright. I believe that is it. This is the only thing that confused Oh no, the quest actually wrapped up this time. Ooh. So yes, I didn't get the elves when I did it before, so that's probably why it didn't wrap up. Now there's a worthy prize. If only twan't so far away. Where's that chest? Is it up top or is it like back here? No, it doesn't matter. All right, so where do I want to go? To start, let's go to this. Okay. I want to go over here. I want to investigate the coastline. I'm pretty sure I can just drop down and make my way over there. How's everybody on health? Are people like dying? Ron's character is dying. Mm. I guess we could go camping just to heal Ron up real fast. I don't know if camping... No, I don't want to. Fuck it. I'll just replace Ron's character when the time comes. Combinations of materials result in different creations. While in another world, well, this is new game. The, when I was playing the game before launch, I got up to new game plus two. But the thing is, you're not going to do everything, you know? Like, for example, first first playthrough. So we're doing basically 100% on this. And we are at 60 hours played. And that's with, like, knowing where everything's at. It's knowing exactly where to go. It's knowing how to do the quests, etc., etc. Doing that blindly would take much longer. Probably more in the range of like, I would say 70 to 75. But like when I did New Game Plus, you know, I wasn't worried about doing everything. So New Game Plus, I basically, I beelined it through the main story quest just to get back to the unmoor, un, uh, unmoored world. I beelined the story, got to unmoored world, 
and then started fighting the like the heavy shit that's in unmoored world that was my whole my whole goal So what is out here? There's gotta be something good out here. Oh no no no! Oh, ho, ho, ho. I would have been bad. I've got a good feeling about this one. Gotta be like a Gore Chimera or Doolahan. There's something. There has to be something. I refuse to believe this is empty. Though it is certainly looking like that's the case. Um, that looks like I could keep going. I'd have to be up on that ledge to do so, though. So I go over here. Yeah, Ice and Chance on Dragon Spite look really good. Ox carts aren't operating anymore, are they? It is perfectly understandable, albeit rather inconvenient. A shame, but the roads have grown ever more perilous of late. Hmm. I figured for sure there was going to be something over here. I would... I would probably need Sorcerer and Mystic Spearhand. I'd have to float and then get across, and then I think I could go along that path. But maybe there's nothing there. I'm, like, convinced in my head. I'm like, there's something! But there might just... There might not be anything, to be honest. Imperial's Forger. This is where you fight the dragon. No, that's where you fight the dragon. Is it here or there? I don't remember. Then... A way to get to New Game Plus from the Unmoored World? Yeah. The Unmoored World doesn't last forever. It, it has a, a finite end to it. It'll eventually just boot you out. But it's like 12 in-game days or something. Which takes quite a while. I feel like I practically need Warfare for the exploration here. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I vastly prefer I this over the first game. Find a good use. Huh. Bell Lord. <laughs> Illumian is really good for killing trash like that. And there's a chest there. What's up, bitch? Let's 
No, he ran right past me. High five. Oh, no high five. Never mind. Lots of undead on the ocean floor. Oh, hang on, there was a chest. I missed the chest. It's incomplete, and once we get DLC expansions, it'll feel like a full package. I wouldn't say it's incomplete. I think it's just, you know, coming coming back from... Bitter Black essentially was like a roguelike, almost, you know? Like, you could keep going back in over and over again. And so, people got used to that. And we don't have that here. They, they want that. I don't think that really means it's incomplete. I think it's more just, you know. People had an expectation of, like, the endless grind. And right now, at least, we do not have the endless grind. No, help me. Help me. Uh, hard mode, hard mode will probably get added, but I think that's the thing the game's missing the most right now. Because by level 50, I'd say, you're basically unstoppable. Like, outside of, uh, you know, like a slime grabbing you, and then you can't fucking move, there are very few enemies that are going to give you the business. of all the gear that drops from the mini bosses uh i don't know all the locations but right now the goal is to just explore The other thing is, I, I think a part of it, like, yeah, it you do reach a spot where it's like, okay, I am murder machine, I'm too easy. But at the same time, like, it's kind of a self-inflicted problem, you know? Like, you know, I could choose not to use a max upgraded Dragon Spite and do less damage. And, you know, by, by extension, the game will be harder. But... I want to use this weapon. So part of it is part of it is absolutely like, you know, a self-made problem, you know? Yeah, you know, use use less pawns, use no pawn, use weaker weapons, like
It very much is just like a self-made problem. Yeah. The game's too easy. What weapon are you using? The best sword in the game. Well, have you considered not using the best sword in the game? No! I want to use the best sword in the game. Well, that's probably why it's too easy. See, I'm on the opposite side of the spectrum. Like, I'm I'm here for the power fantasy, you know. I I want to smash something and watch it just flop and die because my sword was so strong. Oh no 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 no! Shit 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 shit! <sighs> Where do I want to go? Let's go check. Let's go check Harv. I think Harv is evacuated already. We've arrived well enough. Where to next? I think Harv just like evacuates on its own. Purposely not upgrading your weapon makes the game too easy, might feel natural. I mean, yeah, but it's kind of common sense, you know, like... If, if you think something is too easy, there's a multitude of self-employed difficulties, you know? Using less pawns, deciding your, you know, no healing items in combat. You know? Using a, a weaker weapon, you know, there's, there's loads and loads and loads of different things you could do. I think people would just prefer to have a hard mode, because then it's just... Game's hard. They don't gotta think about it, but... The point still remains that, like, there are things you can do to make your experience harder. I think I'm gonna switch back to Thief after I take down Big Fugly, though. Just for the lulls. Hurts. Stay with me. Wait. Buddy. Whoa, buddy. Stab its head, Sarash, just like Daddy taught you. challenge should come from sacrificing weapons and gear. I think if you want more of a challenge and you don't think it is there, I think you can challenge yourself in a variety of ways. Right 
Yeah, I mean, it's like playing Elden Ring, but deciding you're not going to use summons, or... You know, no Ashes of War or whatever. Like, all of those things are ways to increase the difficulty. Motherfucker, stop moving! No oh, shit. He's got a skinny back. No! God damn you and your skinny back. Yeah, I think we gotta get rid of Ron Spawn. She just ain't cutting it. This is why I like Heavensward Slash. Like it just, it, the hitbox on that move will swipe through the whole fucking body. I mean, the, ch the chances are they're likely going to add a hard mode. The first game had hard mode. The point being that, for the time being, hard mode does not exist. Therefore, if you want the game to be harder, there are things you can do to make it harder. Like, I'm not saying, just, just, you know. I'm not saying here it's not, it's, no, no, it's your fault. Just, just use a weaker weapon. The point is, yeah. There probably will be difficulty options at some point. Right now there isn't. Here are some solutions you can implement to make the game harder for yourself. And they probably will end up adding a hard mode in, because that's what the original game had. My curative magics are at your disposal. And I have such mixed feelings about Warrior. Sometimes it takes so long to get knockdowns in fights like that, but once you do. Arc of Might is just like, boop, He's just fucking, just dead, dead, just melted that fucking thing. Master, I'm not sure how much longer I can keep going without rest. I fear for our chances if we were to be set upon now. Yeah, we should rest. Did you upgrade your weapon? No. Knockdown's really not worth it, to be honest. Your the mountain breaker is gonna handle all of your knockdown. So you don't really you don't really need knockdown otherwise. Ugh, oh there we go, we got one scrag. No, dwarving smithing is not going to help knock down in this particular instance. I have tested the shit out of this. Mountain Breaker gets all the knockdowns that are needed. We'll put Sunder back on.
I haven't seen him use Deluvian, so I'm just gonna give him Sunder. Perhaps another night. I can scarce keep my eyes open. Indeed. Surely we've time for a short kip ere we continue on our merry way. I don't even have the ability to rest. Let's just sit. You would gather materials here. It's not so much that there's a knockdown camp as the extra knockdown you're going to get from going one Dwarven is really going to be irrelevant in the scheme of things. Like, as a warrior, two, doing this twice. Well, not that. Like, perfect, two perfect charge mi mountain breakers. Hitting two of those on a dragon in the heart knocks it down. Hitting two of those on a cyclops knocks it down. Two of those on an ogre knocks it down. So, the point being that you already have an ability that is going to fucking knock stuff down very, very easily. And because of that, it's kind of pointless to, to, to worry about upgrading your knockdown, you know? Like, yeah, you might, you, you'll have a little bit more knockdown on your basic attacks, but do you need knockdown on your basic attacks? Blair, Maelstrom, Haggle, Beatrice, we're going to add a marker to you. Levin, Flare, Haggle, and Maelstrom. I don't like Maelstrom as much. All the fights here are outside now. Looks like Beatrice gets it. Beatrice. I happen to understand Elvish. 1181, that's a good fucking sorcerer right there. Goodbye, Ron. I'm gonna send Ron rotten meat. <laughs> All told, I'm rather satisfied. It will be an honor friend. to serve by your side. Alright, now where was that fucking gore came at? You first wake up. I'm just gonna head in that general direction and I'll probably find it. Are you a merchant? Well met. Looking to mm. make a purchase. Much obliged, sir. Our packs are heavier, and our purse is far lighter. Spending so freely offers a unique sort of joy. Well, let's keep our noses to the grindstone, that we might do it again soon. Do I have... I got four on me, and seven all heals? Okay. I want to... F I'm trying to remember where the fuck that Gore Chimera was. You watch where you're going. You'll hurt yourself one of these days. Oh, don't mind me. These things happen. It's near the capital. Well, let's make our way back over there. I wanna. I'm gonna switch to thief anyway. We've gotten a. Uh, I wanted to get lots of arc of mites. I think I've arc of mited plenty of things. Head. Stay down. No, don't do it. Don't get up yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Let it rip. See, I'm standing up though. No big damage. Big whiffs. Master, the 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 from us. 
Honestly, Heavenward Sunder is probably just the best fucking warrior <laughs> Heavenward just, it, it jaw snipes uppercuts constantly. Okay, I'm leaving. God damn, Thundermine. Fucking me up. Fairy stones left and right, man. We got here. What is this? Just a little cave with some uh, glimmer coal. Fuck, I need glimmer coal for, but. Get it, Sarash. Go beat its ass. One that can work in our favor. Right you are. All right. Like a million fucking NPCs. Since time, remember. Draconic. I would like these. I need, I'm going to need some stuff. We're going to go... We're going to go to Thief. We started as a Thief. Shoulder bodge slightly more distance on and being able to barge mid-charging without breaking the charge. I think barge mid-charge would be a little too OP, but I agree the distance is... The distance is very lackluster. It is a very, it's like more of a nudge than a, a, a shoulder check. Get out of my fucking house. Ow! Where the fuck, how do I get up there? It looks like the, uh... I'll be feeling the scores of that battle for some looks like time yet. vocation change should be, like, right here. Seafloor Shrine Vocation Guild, but I ain't seeing Fails anybody. To destroy us only enhances our chances against future adversaries. Ooh. Where's the vocation person? I want- I do not want to be a warrior any longer. Let me change. Oh, I'm dumb. Because we haven't rested, nobody has actually made it over here yet. It has all the icons, like the town is fully populated, but no one's actually here because we haven't rested at all. Do Except for Brant. There is a matter. Bro, I ain't, es I ain't escorting you right now. 
I'm like, where is everybody? Oh, we're not going to be able to burn through that. Earn a palm badge. I want you to hunt down Chimeras. You're not the... Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. There we go. That's more like it. Hoy! Hoy! To overthink it. Hoy! Ah, windstorm. And spirit. Hang on, I, I do need is uh, fucking these guys. Oh, I don't have enough. Um. It you can change it on a whim. You've not. All right. Not interested in that. I could max out sorcerer real fast. I don't want to. I think either I'm either I'm going Mystic Spear Hand and maxing out Spear Hand, or I'm just going to Thief and being a god. Um, I gotta pee though, so how about we put that to a vote? Oh my god, I just realized Arc of Might has a max charge. Yeah, that might be why you're not doing damage. That that could be the problem. Let's vote. Mm. Mm. Chocolate covered pretzels are so fucking good, dude. Mm. Mm. This channel are not excited anymore. What does that mean? What does it mean? 
All right. Um, we got Wild Fury, Dragon's Fin, Ravenous Hand, uh, Devout Offering. No, not in New Game. Always Sky Dragon's Feast to get on top of them. All right, first up, I want Dynamism. I want Zeal. Lethality is good. We'll go Verve. Metal. Trapidity and Thew. That sounds good. Doing business. It's Rosh, get off the chest. What are you doing? Silly boy. That's a lot of shit. Are you consider doing a walkthrough on this game or is it too much? I would not consider doing a walkthrough. Uh, mainly because your pawns guide you through this game as you play. So I don't really think a walkthrough is necessary. Kind of. It, a walkthrough basically goes against like the ethos of this game. Wouldn't make sense. Because if I'm doing a walkthrough, you know, you're that defeats the purpose of you having pawns that tell you like, Oh, Risen, we should go check out this or we should go look at that, you know. Think that's the best shit I have. I mean, honestly, the only time I think walkthroughs are appropriate is when it's a game that is particularly hard, where you're you're going to like have major fuck ups that'll cause you to be like, oh shit. I want to start my playthrough over or something. Oh, I killed this boss the wrong way and now I don't get any loot. That's why it makes sense in Souls games. But Souls games are just, you know, there's ambushes and shit constantly trying to get you. This is more about you going on an adventure. Somebody's holding your hand through that entire adventure. I think that takes away from the experience. All right, we are spear-handed up. I could get the spear-hand weapon. Should I get the spear-hand weapon? I only got 654. Yeah, I am. I like the spear-hand weapon. It looks fucking sick. She's a queer sensation. Remember, draconic... All right, let's see. Oh, I have to buy this for an achievement. Ugh. Do I care about the achievement? I don't think I do. I want Dragon's Vein and Lindworm Fang, and that's probably it. Blood flows to then I bid ye farewell. All right, and now I want to. Where's my Dwarven boy? You're still a grumpy old bitch. What do you do? What kind of smithing do you do? So ask away. My hammer is up. You also do dwarven. Neato. Alright. I already got the knockdown. Yeah, let's do it. Max tier dwarven Lindworm Fang. At your disposal, pleasure doing business with you. Okay, and then I need. But be sure to buy. Just tell me what you need. Batali. 
Damn, bro, you want four bolt scales? And I'll see Come again when you've more... We're gonna start creating forgeries of bolt scales. Oh, hang on. Can I... This might be New Game Plus only. Remember. Draconic blood flows through the vein. Maxed the fuck out. Of lesser drinks. Do I need to spend them? Why not? Well. I'll purchase it just to get the achievement, I guess. Can I bid you fail? I guess it works out that we're going spear hands since I need to, uh... I gotta go hunt down the chest. Should I buy the chest? I don't remember if the chest looked good. Let me see how much of an upgrade it is. Remember. Dragon Knight. It's only 20. Why not? How would the scale skin look? Lame. The Duelist's coat, though. And then the Strider's Greaves. Uh, more magic, less raw defense, and I lose some debilitation. Um, I think I'll just stick with the two that I'm getting already. Actually, hold on. Let me look at this. Is that worth it? Maybe just the duelist's coat. Blood flows through. Then I bid ye farewell. Are you in the market for something? In yes. Particular? Do come again. Remember. Yeah, it just max me out, bro. Draconic blood, then I bid ye farewell. Now we're fucking cooking. Where's that ring? Can I stack that? I don't really need to stack it, to be honest. Where's the special one that's like, boosts everything? Double Ring of Triumph. Mm. I would get what I need. No, I should keep an Endeavor on, I think. Alright. Everyone's here. Let me pull out some heals, too. Because I was... Curatives. I got three. Ink out seven of those. And about five of those. Alright, now we're good. Okay, um, so I came down that way. I guess we take that way. And then we'll... Take the seafloor path all the way back over to here. Stop? 
What has happened to this place? Was it not once underwater? Some old that it soared up into the very sky. What fell magics have brought these decrepit bones to life? I shan't allow any further harm to come to you. Well done! Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. No skeletons are escaping. Oh, you already got the slime? Good. A treasure chest. My mistake is really another spot for gathering ah. Damn, you just drop kick me? What the shit? Guy came out of nowhere. Coming in and drop kicking me. do just, just just shit out fairy stones once you get into unmoored efficiency at its best hey you I, I need there, your your skills hand those over Made it to Harv, okay. I'd like to find all of the stuff on the map that's holding the rare armors. I don't know all the locations, though.
Berry stone. Man, these guys are so stingy with their bolt scales, bro. Just hand over the bolt scales. Doesn't help if they're everywhere if they don't want to give up their loot. Oh, this class is definitely OP. We are none of us alike in vocation. That is most fortuitous. I see it as a glad thing. And does somebody say Spearhand's not OP? Spearhand definitely OP. We get Force Stun, and then Force Clone, and then Instant Stamina Refill. I'm not even using the most OP thing this class has. This class has an ability that just makes you invulnerable to all damage. This way, are we right on the outskirts of... I guess that is the one we killed earlier. Was that thing following me? My my pawns, you mean? Hey man, invincible bubble, teleport onto target, keep target perpetually slowed so it can't move, air dash, like I would I would say Mystic Spearhand is probably one of the most well-rounded classes in the game. Just because it's able to handle any situation. Things are far away, you can jump on top of them. Things are close, you can beat the shit out of them. You get a a parry that you can time and uh, land right on top of stuff. You can. Ah, you're fighting something that's magic resist, you can do magical blades of energy to shoot at it, like. I mean, magic archer, you know, obviously martyr bolt is insanely good. But with magic archer, if something climbs on top of you, like, you really have no answer for it. Once something decides, like, I'm gonna ride your ass, you don't really have a, a defense as magic archer against that. As spear hand, like you are the ass rider. Here, an enchantment of coal to freeze our toes. My skeleton. Another bolt scale. All right. I might put on the. Uh, there's a trickster perk which will like increase the drop chance of uh, of shit. I might put that on. Just play fighter. Fighter is like Mystic Knight, just without your cannon. You're still a parry god. Like these things. These things were a huge pain in the ass to kill when I was playing on my warrior. But against Spearhand... We got magic beams.
though. I mean, given we have a sorcerer now, too. Oh, Mr. Doolahan. Got a shield for me, Liliana. We're gonna get the big freeze. That fucking stun is so annoying. And boom! Hand over your bones. All of the bones. They're all mine. The best thing about this class, though, is just this. Sky Dash. What hope have we against the whims of the sky? All right, so we should be close. Where was that? Where was that fucking Gore Chimera at? Was it up there? I want that Gore Chimera. Hmm. I, mean, I think we would see it though. Are we sure up there? I don't see it up there. It was like the start of the stream, wasn't it? Yeah, hang on. Let me see. Um, let me rewind and see where this Gore Chimera was at. Uh, so we did Batal. We got through Batal. I left Batal. I did that mission. There's Snake. It was before Snake. So you evacuated the people of Batal. Evacuated Batal. Where did I warp to? I warped to Vernworth. No, did I? Or did I go... Where was that? Where did I warp to? I think I warped to the Elvish village. Yeah, I warped to the Elvish village. Fought the worm. After the worm. Worm took a minute. Then we went to... Then we went to Seafloor Shrine. I talked to them. Then I did Vernworth. I went through Vernworth's quest line. Where there's this fucker at? Hang on, it should be like right around here. Okay, so we're at the bridge on Vernworth. We're running across the bridge, looking for our way down. I was talking about cake, and how I wanted the cake. Where are you, Gore Chimera? Is 
it here. This is like where I'm at right now. I was fighting shit. I don't see it. I like distinctly remember being like, there's the Gore Chimera. I want it. But I didn't have uh, the mobility I needed to like get up to it. So I ignored it. Is it here? Fuck are you, Chimera? Watch him. We started running down. Started running past all the undead. There's the chest. I don't know, man. Maybe it wasn't there. Oh, was that it? True that? That's probably where it was. Okay, hold up. Oh, hang on. Is there anything else here for me? I guess I could follow that whole path around. I should do that while we're out here. Ow. Check it down. What fell from the beast as it breathed its last? So we'll circle around. I know, yeah, it's it's over back where we, uh... Liliana, top me off. Give me... How might I be evade? You know how to be evade. There we go. With me, Arisen. Wait a moment. Was the best aspect of this game? Uh, the freedom of the combat. Really just freedom in general. Like, the freedom in the combat, the freedom to approach quests however the fuck you want. The freedom to pick up somebody and yeet their ass off a cliff. Very few games just allow you to just, you know, do whatever you want. And combat is still fucking peak, man. Like... You know, if you were to stack this up against, like, other big open-world medieval RPGs, like, this this combat is absolutely peak. Like, Souls has better bosses by far, I don't think anyone's gonna argue that. But the, the actual, like, combat here and how it works, I would take this over Souls any day. Like, Souls is good, but Souls is not the strongest when it comes to combat. I mean, let's, let's be honest, it's... You know, light attack, heavy attack, dodge, parry, you know, your running attacks. It's it's simple. Here, I'm fucking... Like, imagine imagine if you were playing Souls and you climbed on top of the Hydra to cut off its head instead of sitting at the edge of the water and waiting for it to attack so you could slap it. It'd be wild. Yeah, where are you? Agamemnon Volcanic Camp? No, no. Uh, that? No, it's Volcanic Island. I think the closest would be like... No, the closest would be the... Uh, seafloor Shrine. And I just exit on the south side. Took nearly a moment. Now that we're here, what did you have in mind, Arisen? I think it's decent, maybe a 6.5 out of 10. Ooh. Ooh. Nah, this is this is this is my game of the year right now. 6.5 out of 10. Jesus. I don't want to know what your scoring rubric is. I gotta exit town from the south, I believe. But what if I... Hang on, have I exited this way before? Yeah, no, I did. I did that, right? I believe so. Oh, the first one. Uh, I would put the first one at like an 8. I mean, for when it came out... Like... Let's let's talk. So so Dark Arisen came out in what? 
Let's see. Uh, 2012 and Dark Arisen was released in 2013. So, actually, hold up. I'm going to... I'm going to sort channel by date. So, in terms of the types of RPGs we were getting then, we had, like, Assassin's Creed 3. We had Far Cry 3. Uh, bum, 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 bum. The DMC Reboot. Devil May Cry. I'm trying to find. Let me better yet. Let me just search RPGs in 2012. Uh, Kingdoms of Amalur came out. Mass Effect Three came out. Diablo Three. Skyrim came out. Like Skyrim is probably the only thing that's like this type of setting that came out back then. Witcher 2, true, Witcher 2 what was around. Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition PC. So we had, we had like, Skyrim. That's it. I've had enough. Skyrim, Dark Souls, Witcher 2. Which like, out of all those games, I would say the combat in the original, I'd still put ahead. It was just like, I don't know, man, you can't... Dra Dragon's Dogma just has such a unique combat that I just don't think other games, like, stack up to. Because it comes down to the freedom, you know? Like, I think the best moment in this stream was when we were fighting that Cyclops. I climbed on top of him. I put a bomb on his eye. I gouged his eye out, leaping off. I detonated the bomb as I hit the ground. That staggered his ass. I threw ropes around his legs. That yanked his feet out from under him. He smashed his face into a fucking wall, fell down, and then I did like a spin to win on his face and killed him. Like, that kind of dynamic action, there's just too, like, you don't get that freedom in almost anything. And it was jankier, sure, but you could do shit like that back in, uh, back in Dark Arisen, too. Like... It's just, that's freedom, you know? Like... No, Skyrim's combat is not that good. Skyrim's combat is at its best when it is pumped full of mods. And I mean pumped. That game, you gotta, it's gotta be modded out the ass to have, like, good combat. Damn, Mara went with the make your own spell system. That was wild. I remember I had a uh, a disintegration spell, and it was like it was just like a super it was a super super strong ass fireball, but it would do like it was like a max level fireball. And then with like the AOE expanded to be fucking huge. 
And then I would also paralyze the target for like 300 seconds and I'd turn them invisible. So the whole idea was I would hit them with this mega fireball. And then afterwards, the enemy was gone because they were turned invisible and they were paralyzed. So it just looked like I disintegrated them. And uh, young me thought that was the coolest fucking thing in the world. I was like, that's so cool. Would you compare Dogma and Rebirth? I think they're two very different games for very different audiences. Like for starters, Rebirth is infinitely more story heavy than this. And you're more on the rails, you know? It's, it's more of a guided RPG experience. Dragon! Oh, I'm coming, buddy. Don't you worry. Is this where... Yes, okay, so the, the Chimera should be around here. What's up, you big bitch? On your back, you can't do anything about it. I knocked me off. Where are the other bombs at? Is this just me and Sirash? Okay, they haven't despawned. I gotta knock him down for before I can really go into the, the fury. But I can do this. Come here. the other pawns are but we're about to get cooked out uh sirash
made me knock down Siraj. Beatrice, knock his ass out of the air so I can kill him. Oh, somebody's getting maelstromed in midair? Oh, you're getting fucked up. Yeah, pro tip, you shouldn't stand in the tornado like that. This is just a dragon. This is no, not a final boss. Just, just something to kill. Must save it for a time of dire need. All right. So now the question is, where is that fucking gore chimera? Honestly, I'm not sure if there's anything in the in these these big dark parts. I think it's just like vast. Nothingness. I shall hasten to your aid. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait right there. Uh, where do we want to go? Oh, there's the whole whole river system over here. Could go investigate that. I know there's like the rare helmets, but they're, I don't know if I really want to go around and get them. They're just like, they're just unique helmets for each of the individual classes. I could, I guess, but like, don't really offer me anything, you know? Oh, another dragon. Oh, we got to get down. How do we get down? Oh, that was almost bad. Look, master, a treasure chest. I'm gonna get you, don't worry, buddy. You just stay right there. Oh, are you coming up? Okay, yeah, come up and play. Oh, he's dead. I didn't see she slapped a flare on his chest. Hey, you're fucked. Goodbye, Mr. Dragon. If I might be so bold as to speak my mind. Speak up, Sarash. Share your truth. All right, that was a, a mild fall. It's worth it, I think. A 
bet there's like, I bet he was guarding a chest or something down there. There's gotta be treasure. Why else would a dragon be down on the seafloor if there's not some kind of goodie? What goodie were you hiding? Methinks there are rare materials to be found. My treasure senses were tingling. Well spotted. So Van Garter's Greaves. What are those? They're not better than what I have. Uh, Sirash, are they better than what you have? Maybe fully leveled up? They have decent debilitation resists. Hmm, how do I feel about the fashion of those? I do think the fashion matches better. I will probably max those out. I've actually been thinking, because like this I maxed out pure physical. I think I'd be better off maxing out Elvish on them. Because like, Warrior doesn't really have anything to, to mitigate out uh, magic damage, you know? Um, let me see, uh, unmoored world loot. Um. There was a Reddit post about it. I might as well go get it. I might as well get all of it. Search unmoored world. Um, Moored World, um, Final Beam, Unmoored Weapons, Your Armor, One person said that there's better weapons, and someone else says these are all purchased from merchants. Mavis, five gift subs coming in. <laughs> um, that's a regular one. Um, let me try searching this by sort by time. Um, where was that post at? Where was it? Um, Unmoored world loot. Try searching Dragon Forge. I'm um I'm from my Dragon Forge. You can post on my world. No. Um. Where the fuck? Hmm. World ending. Of course, the fucking wiki isn't up to date yet. Hang on, let me try searching by the equipment itself. If somebody had a post, there's eight pieces that you can find. Let's search for Van Garter's Greaves. Armor questions. I think this might be it. Um,
Okay, in post game, uh, chest dried up river east of the checkpoint rest town, monarch's crown. Somebody had a post that like detailed all of these. This one has a couple, but not all of them. Two kerchiefs. I do Burko Cavern partway through, jump a cliff with an area of a dragon. We're just gonna keep Next going up. I'll probably find them. Can you get one million gold? I just play the game. Play the game, sell old gear. Where was Guerco Cavern? I do Guerco Cavern partway through, you can drop down a cliff area with a dragon on the chest. Southeast. Of the Forgotten Rift, Rift Stone. Forgotten Rift, Rift Stone. Essence Breach is one of the water areas. Quirko Cavern, partway through, you can drop down into a cliff area. So it might be up. Oh, I'm probably going to pass by them in a second. Because this is Guerco Cavern. Uh, these are these are like all single items you can get. I don't believe they respawn at all. Here. Master, my heart knows no greater peace than when I'm by your side. No, this is this person's looking for Vanguard or Greaves. That's what we already got. Where do they fucking find that? How do they know the names of these items? What do I need? I did that one. Uh, this was five days ago. Locating a few items and Venator's leggings, Conqueror Sabatons are at Marshland Settlements in the Lake Umor World side of a chest. Okay, Marshland Settlements. I could go there. Is this dead ended? Let's go. Oh, yeah, I can't. I'm sliding, I think. Um. How do I want to do this? There? That's going to be my closest. We seem to have arrived without issue. But are we safe here? At times, I find myself wondering why we must fight against our fellows. Is that you, son? Ooh. One of us has been drenched. Most impressive, us. Like there was a waterfall here. Is there anything back where the waterfall used to be? I'm streaming on both Twitch and YouTube at the moment. So, I have a little thing that just has both chats. What's that? What's this big purple light? What's happening over here? Is that a gore? I think that's a gore. Here, an 
enchantment of cold to freeze our foes. Down you go. Ah! Who did that? Who did that? Which one of you shitty mages did that? Good job, Beatrice. Mm, I didn't bonk anybody. Did someone get bonked? I'm busy bonking Gore Chimeras. I ain't got time to bonk people in chat. Oh, we're talking about dude from yesterday. Was he trying to get bonked again? It's a big ugly. Now you're dead. This is why I said this class is, like, just incredibly solid. Like, it doesn't matter what we're up against. Like, you can take down fucking everything. How would I say this compares to Elden Ring? Uh, if you liked the feeling of going on a big adventure in Elden Ring, you'll probably like this just as much. Plays very differently, though. Not a Souls like at all. Someone saw fit to camp here. The road turns terrible. Twould behoove us. Now the flames before it is too late. Like, Elden Ring, I think you're playing it more for, like, the challenge, at least I'd assume so, if you're playing a 
a Souls game, I think a big part of that is you want the challenge. Uh, this is... This is a lot more power fantasy. Like, by the end of this game, if if you are using, like, the right skills and the right weapons, you should be able to beat the absolute shit out of anything you're going to fight. Like, no question, you should bully the shit in this game. Whereas in Elden Ring, bullying is a little more iffy. I think Dark Arisen is better than base TD2. Nah, man. I don't know where y'all are coming up with this. The the combat upgrades in Dogma 2 alone put it just literally leagues ahead of the original. Like, Warrior... Warrior alone. Warrior alone makes this a better game than the original in Dark Arisen just how much better warrior is than how it used to be mystic spear hand is fucking wild magic archer actually feels like it has more of an identity now as opposed to being just archer but auto track thief is fucking goaded now fighters better like i firmly believe that anyone that believes dark arisen is better than this just has some insane rose tinted goggles on because they are completely different categories at this point. It is generally used as a material. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. I don't even miss Assassin. You can basically play Assassin as Warfare. Just give yourself a bow and then give yourself daggers and give yourself sword and shield. And boom, you're an assassin. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait a moment. Watch out for the knackers, master! Mage gets anodyne built into its core kit. So every mage now has healing. Healing actually feels necessary this time around. Stone can whisk us here whensoever we desire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it makes sense she wouldn't be here. Alright, so I'm trying to get to... Well, there's that. I don't know what's down there. We could check that out, and then... The Misty Marshes would be emptied out as well. It's a lot, though. What do we had on time? What, three and a half hours? Up in, well, like, 30 minutes, I think, would be a good, good metric. Um, What do I want to do? Let's go... Let's go to Misty Marshes first. I've got a good feeling about this one. I suppose we might as well gather what we can. Poison ought to be cured with all due haste. I mean, we're probably going to get something similar to Bitter Black. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. I would be very surprised if we don't see some form of DLC. Even with all the, the oh, even with all the bullshit that was happening on social media, I'd imagine the game's still selling well. I 
when you do post game, you got to clear the red clouds out first. After you clear out the red clouds, you have like, I don't know the exact time. I've heard 10 days, I've heard 12 days. As long as you're not resting a bunch, like I don't rest at all in post game, I just keep going. Because at this point in the game, you have a shit ton of wake stones and a shit ton of all heals. What's up, Bell Nerd? No, ah, you're gonna hit me. Ow. Have my support. Another one, man, these motherfuckers are everywhere up here in Unmored. Anything to cure poison? Oh, 
Oh, you're real weak to magic. What are y'all, uh, what are we buffing up against? No, I need to go up here. Yeah, okay, hang on. I missed the turn. This way. Then I shall remain by your side. The same strategy with Fawn's Link game, only assign a couple of their most powerful skills, so they proc often rather than cycling through fuel menu of options. I mean, I <clears throat> I give my pawns four skills. I don't... I saw, like, one dude that, like, had his warrior only with Skyward Slash. Um, if you want to, like, force the AI to just do one thing, you can do that, but... I'd rather give him everything and just hope that the pawn ends up using it right. Did you last save at an inn? Uh, the start of the... Or right after Unmoored World, so he's probably like 62? I would guess 62. Okay. Eternal Riftstone. Either you Eternal Riftstone, or you like wait 10 days and it should just, uh, not 10 days. I think it's a week. I don't know. People in town respawn. All the key NPCs will respawn after some point. Just takes time.
Man, I hate these fucking skellies. Yeah, I'm ready for the DLC. It should be good. Maelstrom was probably a bit excessive, but, you know. It gets the job done. Watch your footing, master. Losing your balance on an incline this sharp could be perilous. Like we got a Doolahan out here and some other shit to explore. Oh no, you're not a doula hand. Oh shit, it's a fell lord and one of these guys? Rush, smash it. Cardinal robe. What's that? Ooh, the sorcerer robe. Think what we can achieve if we hold our talents further. I don't think lock on is needed. I don't think it really makes sense here either. Yeah, all right. Now that it's now that it's dead, she uses the fucking maelstrom. What's this? Let's see. Um, Conqueror Sabatons are at Marshland Settlement. Marshland Settlement? Marshland Settlement. Mm -hmm. Mm. I'm gonna have to find find a list of all these locations. Honestly, I prefer Bull Eyed over Maelstrom. Maelstrom is I don't know. 
It's it, it's not bad, but I hate how you when Maelstrom's up, you can't fucking see anything. Talos said landed and doesn't give crystals. I'm pretty sure you get crystals for it though. Like some I don't remember where. Somewhere out there. Cause I remember I found it on my other character. I went somewhere and I got like Oh. Friend. I just killed the big version. It's nothing like Dark Souls. The only thing this game has in common with Dark Souls is that they're both like dark gothic. That's it. What fell magics have brought these decrepit bones to life? Doesn't play like Dark Souls, doesn't feel like Dark Souls. If I might be so bold as to speak my mind, is your pack not overburdensome? You carry so much, I worry for your poor spine. I think I was looking, it says there's a chest here. Right there, well hidden chest. I'm gonna have to just find that post that detailed all the locations if we're gonna hunt them down. What could yon chest be hiding? You must know. Let us hope your curiosity will be rewarded. Didn't see any other chest down here. I mean, we got that robe. That's old. It's not good. Let me see how this would compare. Compared to what she's wearing. I mean, Magician's Coat is shit. Cardinal Robe. Let me give it to, like, Liliana and see how it would compare to hers. Okay, so Cardinal Robe upgraded is very good, for sure. It would probably by bypass all of those with full upgrades. Let me get that. All right. Either way, it's uh, it's almost five. I'm going to try and find that list of all the rare loot, and we'll wrap up here, and then uh, tomorrow we'll focus on killing the super bosses. Well, not really super bosses, but killing killing the unmoored world bosses and getting the rare loot and that'll end up uh bring us to a close so uh we're gonna close out for now i'll catch y'all tomorrow probably same time right around one o'clock so y'all have a good monday and i will catch you then